Hello and welcome everyone to the walk around video here at your next car, the 2016 66 Reg M140 five door hatch. The vehicle is presented in a sapphire black metallic, it's a superb high spec example of the M140 five door hatch. As with all of our vehicles, it's physically in stock, ready to be driven away. There are no hidden extras, so how you see the car is how you'll purchase it. If you would like to know more details, including prices, funding options, or anything further, do simply go ahead and check the description box, and I will leave contact and web link details available there for you. If you would prefer to get in touch directly, you can, of course, do so, and the, the contact details are available below. We can be contacted via text, email, WhatsApp, telephone, all of the usual contact routes. You'll find easy-to-use finance calculator over through our website. But let's get in now to talking about this lovely high-powered M140 five-door hatch then. So with the M140 then, they produce just over 330 brake horsepower, which is an astounding figure for such a small, lightweight hatchback. Really fantastic looking vehicle. You've got a lovely, lovely amount of kit on this car. It's got the original M140 alloy wheels. We've had them freshly refinished in the ferric grey. As you can see, so they're now looking back to their factory fresh look. Behind those, of course, you get the M compound brakes with that amount of power on offer. Of course, not only do they look nice, but of course they are going to give that stopping power that will be required. This one does come with the full in-house enhancement kit. So we've gone for the gloss black front splitter. You've got the matching kidney grills. It has also got the shadow line exterior. So you get these little pieces around here on the front grills and the same for the mirror caps. As you can see, slightly darker on those. Then you've got the side sill extensions and YNT M performance decals. You've got rear privacy glass. Being the five door, I happen to think not only do the one series in general look better in the five door, but the M versions certainly do benefit from being a five door for many reasons. But not only that, but it makes it a bit more practical. You've got the rear spoiler extension here. You've got rear LED lights. You've got the M140 i badges, of course. Then the gloss black rear diffuser. This vehicle has received a M performance exhaust upgrade. So, of course, we'll get a chance to have a listen to that. So you can see the M tips there. So again, really nice performance upgrade in terms of the exhaust there. And you can see for yourself just how nice and clean and tidy this car is in that sapphire black. I think it's a really nice color for this vehicle. It's quite an unassuming car, if you will, from the outside, you can almost get away with it looking like a regular one series, which if you're anything like me, you kind of like that. Because of course, you know, from being the potential owner of this car that it isn't and is far from being a regular one series with that amount of power on board but it still retains being a very practical hot hatch you've got a full 3c isofix rear bench plenty of space in there you have still got a very usable size boot area as well so as you can see in there really nice and neat and tidy plenty big enough to to be used every single day which is just one of the many things that is so appealing about hot hatches and hyper hot hatches such as this one. Really had a boom in the market since the release of this car's slightly less powerful little brother with the M135i. And then, of course, this car came along shortly after. Front seats then, of course, you've got that lovely coral red Dakota leather, which is a great colourway for this car. You've got the Harman Kardon audio, which, of course is up there in terms of popular options. As we go back towards the driver's side then, we'll go through, take a seat inside, and of course, first of all, start the vehicle up and be able to run you through a couple of the interior functions and features. We have got the multi-function steering wheel, of course. You've got cruise control, speed limiter, voice and volume functions. You have, of course, got the paddles for the eight-speed sports automatic gearbox. So of course, from the moment you start the car up, on the initial start up, it is going to be nice, loud and leery, but it will soon quieten down and can be used every single day without being too noisy for you. Cars cover just over 59,000 miles. Has got the professional wide nav and media option, so that's your nav view. You've got Bluetooth, telephone and audio. You've got DAB, music collection, AUX and USB lining. 
And then if we go into the service status menu, it's not dual service for 17,000 miles. Service issue wise, are three BMW recorded services. We have also got all of the paper documents to back those services up, so the VHC checks from BMW, which you can of course more than happily have a look through. And underneath the sliding armrest, we have also got the wireless charging tray. It does also come with a rear facing reversing camera, as you can see there. And then if I just drop the car into sport, that'll open up both sides of the M Performance exhaust. And the car has been warming up for a little while whilst we've been taking pictures. So you get that lovely noise. I'm not going to go too mad inside the showroom for obvious reasons. But it is certainly a lovely noise upgrade from that M Performance exhaust. If you'd like to know more details on this stunning M140i five-door hatch, then do simply check the description box. But for the time being, thank you. Do take care. Bye-bye.